Welcome again to our series of videos, The Researcher. As uh, you know and has been told many times on these videos, this series is about uh, deep investigations on uh, some of the most interesting parts of our culture, of our studies. Today, uh, I was wondering about, uh, following all the studies we've been doing those days and months, uh, I was wondering how could this be applied to uh, more real situations. I don't know really if there is a name for this study. I, uh, I did ask my master here, Sidoshi Luis Nogueira, uh, if, uh, if there was a, a perspective uh, more applied to real situation, and in this, in this case, who was the name of, the, of this study. Uh, I would like to share with you uh, his answers and his uh, deep and big knowledge, and if he makes me the honor to, to do so. Hello, Sidoshi, Sumimasen. Could you tell us about this, uh, this, this topic? Of course. Thank you very much, Isis, for the solar videos, for uh, asking me to, to solve your questions and your investigations. Well, um, from, the, from the perspective of reality, we need to understand that many times uh, when you are <coughs> Studying a classical culture, it could be, uh, it could seem that you are out completely of reality. But of course, when we are talking about Bujutsu and other special, uh, other special studies inside uh, these classical disciplines, these classical subjects, there are in many situations uh, specific studies based on reality. The way to answer to your question today, it's I think the most interesting thing is what it's called Koto Jutsu. By the master, it's called Koto Jutsu. Ko comes from chi side, that means small, and to it comes it comes from tatakai, that means war. Then it's the art Jutsu is the art, the art of the small uh, of the small war. And they were forms uh, to cause um, uh, to, to scare the enemy and also perform things based on real, on the reality uh, of these things. Then I think that for talking about all this topic, the best way would be that uh, let's make a trip around many, many things that we could understand for a first perspective because this study goes beyond because you have to study in deep what is, uh, what is victimology, you need to understand what are the common reactions, you need to understand protection, uh, street vision and many, many of you have to manage uh, crisis, you have to manage emotional parts, psychological then it's a broad study, this is not something that you will learn in one month class or, or a, a less in this, in this research series, but uh, it could be a good introduction uh, for you into these studies if we could go for a trip, for example, uh, of, the, of several parts, of several ideas that we could cover in this video. Hashi okay? Now, first of all, uh, let's, uh, let's take a look, for example, into situations that you could maybe understand. If you have, for example, a tanto and you have on the OB, now, the idea would be that maybe you are going to be training in a palace, in a normal situation, that uh, in a, in a inside, inside a uh, hall or inside palace situation then I, if you try to attack me and I maybe try to stop like it seems in many of the videos of course I want you to react then the most uh, common situation is that you will be nervous and like of course these nerves make you to stop, stop again and make difficult movements to uh, understand what is happening or why are you behaving in this way. Then, for example, if you do it like that way, one more, one, uh, uh, and at the end, I will be. It will be impossible. If you are a more professional uh, warrior, a more professional.
professional assassin. Hi. For example, when you go to this way and I stop you, you will turn the knife, cut one side, one Hi. side, until you kill me. Because you are professional in that way. Hi. Then, of course, we have to understand the basic mechanics of what is the killing, what is the reality in order, in order to avoid this kind of circumstances. Hi. Then, let's watch a little details about that. When you come, the first of all, of course, we cannot stop like this way. Mm -hmm. Slow. Exactly. Uh, slow or soft. You need to do it fast, going forward and stopping right to this side. Okay, but in this way, my strength, my weight won't be, uh, won't be enough to defend against your knife and against your intention because you are a killer, you are a professional in that way. Then the following thing that we need to understand him is to isolate, to isolate the weapon, to isolate uh, what is the possibilities. Then I will go out one more time. Please. I stop here in order to have control, go to the ground and right now I go to my side in order to uh, have control and protection. Take a look here. We have the ground, mm -hmm. okay? Because we are trying to isolate your weapon to the ground. Because if I try to, uh, to only to grab, of course, you will yeah. regain force on your hara and go out, helping with your hand. Hi. And of course, this go. could cut me, and this will be the idea. But no, in this case, we are here. Hashi the hashi. following thing I will do, a stepping, a stepping with this foot backward, I will enter here to have conditions to isolate more the force of your hara as your hashi. conditions to come here. Hashi hashi. And from here, I will push in order to wake the ground, and then I will control hashi. here. As you could see, hashi hashi. Have control, I could pass over. Okay, and have control here in order to restrain all, sin all sin circumstances that could uh, react against myself. Hi. Of course, take a look. I have control here and I have this uh, strong position in order to uh, guarantee my defense against your knife. That is the most dangerous spot that you are having here. Hi, Shilashi. The same will happen if you try to attack here. Hi. Many people think that stopping here, it would be enough. But of course, when you are in that way, you will turn that, that stuff. And it will be impossible Hi. to guarantee my safety in these kind of circumstances. Then the first thing when we enter, we enter forward. Okay? Hi. It's the first thing that we have to do. Hi. And of course, if I try to go backwards, Hi. you could react and you could relocate, you replace yourself in order to defend it. Then after here, of course, go to the ground and having this control on this way. Okay? I am waiting me down. Hi. I have my, this both control here. Okay? Because my weight is waiting on your humerus, Hi. okay, on your scapula, on your shoulder. My pressure comes to you in order to go downside your hara, your abs, Hi. and you're unable to react. And Hi. from here, I could have these strong situations in order to take out, of course, the knife, having control, maybe making pressure. I have control of your body but making pressure here to the ground in order to make this kind of reality defense. Because we are not basing on high circumstances that, high, that you are uh, maybe with capability to react. High we are talking about real assassins, real killers that are trying, but this is in traditional. Okay, but this could be applied or studies to be applied on more, more modern ways that this is something that we use not to, to, to explain, that we don't use to, to, to talk about. Hi, Shidoshi. Hi, Shidoshi. Next way, for example, 
If I, I, I am told that you are an assassin, that you I, will be a very violent assassin, that someone, or for example, if you have said that anyone that uh, reads you, you will catch, you will, you will stop, you will kill with a knife, then please, I will explain why there are several ways to apply it. For example, looking here to the camera, in I order that my explanation comes to you, I, am, I will do the following. Hi, sir. If I try by my back to, to push you by your, by your shoulder, your scapula, or your, or your arms, of course, you are strong enough, and from this, you, I won't be capable. You will uh, draw your knife, and you will kill me turning back. I see then, of course, the first thing I have to control your, your arms, because your arms is a way that you could draw a sword, you could draw a knife, or whatever. I see that. My shoulder will push on your back, especially on your shoulder scapula area, with the idea of moving you forward. I see that. From here, I go to this point in order to protect. I see right same. now, while my weight, or while my, my hips are weighing you down, okay, your hara is extended and it's very difficult to reach you, okay, they try to recover, but of course, you will move, moving your hips, I you will you. move your back. I, I need to take out your energy here, then I go, I could, I could clap I on your head, move up, Taking here and of course grabbing and this will take out. Of course you could wait here and having control to the ground, putting uh, here and pressing here in order to control. Of course this could be out and we have the control in order to defend against this kind of enemy. Or tradition, the season where so Specialists in employing, for example, what is in the Nawa. Ah, it's a rope, for example, like that. This rope were also very, very interesting study regarding ah, this. It's a special weapon used to, to uh, maybe to choke and doing several things around the neck, ah, around the body, not only to restrain, but also, as I have explained, to choke or to kill. Ah, okay? Then, uh, this would be also explained for uh, higher levels. High the private session. High but this, I think it's enough only for having a small perspective, a first perspective of what is this kind of Koto Jutsu. That it's a broad study talking about reality, talking about what things are studied to work or what, what, uh, what ideas is not working in a uh, reality situation for protection or defense purpose. Hi, Shidoshi. And I hope you have I, I have solved with my explanation your, your question. Yeah, of course. Don't worry, you got to If you have seen, um, not only uh, our concepts and theories can be applied uh, to, to a more dojo situation, they can, apply, they can be applied uh, with a really interesting application on uh, real situations. Keep uh, tuned uh, to our channel to see new and more interesting uh, concepts and videos of this series and all the series of our studies. Thank you so much.